Hello everyone, my name is Joe Baker, and as mayor of Kennedy, Texas, every week I've been bringing you COVID-19 updates to report the latest information we have on COVID-19 and just how severe the outbreak is currently in Carnes County. So let's take a look at the numbers for this week. As we've been doing each week, I've been visiting covidactnow.org, which shows the latest data on COVID-19 here in Carnes County. So we'll click on Texas, and then we'll scroll over and kick, click on Carnes County, Texas. As you can see, we're still at risk level severe, same as we were last week, which is the highest of these five risk levels shown here on the left, ranging from green to dark red. As we scroll down the page, we can take a look at vaccination levels. And the latest vaccination level for Carnes County in terms of percentage of total population is 46.9%. As we continue down the page, we can look at the average daily reported cases and the latest number is 14.4 cases for Carnes County, which calculates to 92.5 per 100,000 population. And as we can see, for the last several months, we've been up here in the extreme range of the scale. It bounces up and down, but currently it's right at 14.4 average daily cases per day. Taking a look at the state map and the counties here in Texas, we can see we are still the darkest shade of red at the severe risk level range, as is DeWitt County. Goliad County is in the low range, indicated by the color green shown here. Most of the counties in our region are red, which is on the high end of the risk scale. So to summarize for this week, in terms of average daily number of reported cases, last week we had 17.3, this week slightly fewer with 14.4, still in the extreme range in terms of the number of reported cases. In terms of risk level, we remain at the severe risk level, same as we were last week, which is the highest of five risk levels, going from low to medium to high to very high and severe. In terms of total number of COVID-19 cases, last week we had 3,701 total reported cases. This week we have 3,802, an increase of 101 cases. In terms of the total number of COVID-19 deaths, last week we reported 51 deaths here in Carnes County, and this week that number has risen to 52. As always, my prayer is for everyone to do whatever they can do to keep themselves safe and healthy and keep their community safe and healthy. Thank you for listening. For more information about the coronavirus vaccine, please call the Otto Kaiser Memorial Hospital vaccine line at 830-583-9380.